How can the water of baptism do such great things? It's only water. Plus God's Word. Matthew chapter 28, verse 19. Therefore, go and make disciples of all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. We've now come to the fourth part of Luther's large catechism. We've covered the Ten Commandments. We've covered the Apostles' Creed. We've covered the Lord's Prayer. And now we take a, a look at the two sacraments. First of all, baptism. Uh, two sacraments which Luther says every Christian must know, every Christian must have in their life. Um, and the big idea, I'll just get it right out of the way, right away, the big idea today The big idea today is it is at God's command. Um, how do I know people should be baptized? God has given a command. How do I know? It, it looks so simple. Just putting water on somebody's head. Just an, an external act. No. Even if it were just an external act, it's at God's command. Because of God's command, it makes it not a trifling, not a, a social uh, event that can be observed or omitted, but it is commanded by God. Now, it looks so simple. It looks, and for that reason, people despise it. Uh, they, they, they pull it away from God's word. They, they try to tear it asunder as though it's only water. No, the command of God has, puts his word in with that water so that this ordinary water becomes a, a divine water. It's at God's command. And, and because of that, um, it's God's work. When we baptize in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, God is doing the work. It only looks like it's our work. God is working through our hands, but it is His work. And here's where Luther uh, goes into uh, the difference between uh, these fancy man-made works that people say are, are so wonderful. And he talks about Carthusians. That's the word he uses for the monks of Chartres. And uh, um, the, today they, they make chartreuse, if you're uh, aware of that. Uh, kind of like Christian Brothers makes brandy chartreuse from the monks at Chartres. And, um, but what wonderful and, and amazing things they do. Luther says, you can pile them all up and it's not worth one thing compared to what God does. How do I know that? Because God is a better, you look at the person doing the work. An evil person doing something that appears good, it's an evil work. It comes from an evil person. God, the greatest, the highest, the most holy being there ever could be. He does such a simple thing like baptizing. This is a more noble work than all the religious pilgrimages, all the um, self-imposed religious rituals of mankind. Um, baptism, it's at God's command. A washing of water, uh, a, a water of life through that word of God. Take a look at the materials today. Um, after you've watched this video, read the materials, go through the discussion question. I think there's uh, only one available for you this time. React to it on the um, GroupMe staff meeting page and respond to one of your colleagues. See you next week.